first met Sharon. I knew. Uh, she would be my wife. She was perfect. Oh, so animated and, and passionate. And she still is. But, uh, but uh, things are different now. Uh, before we married, Sharon agreed. No pets. <sighs> so much for promises. I guess I shouldn't have complained about her buying so many shoes. Because now she's bringing home goats. Chickens. Sharon, uh, hi, um, uh, I don't know how, but somehow one of your, uh, sheep's or llama's hair or wool or whatever the, whatever it is, uh, landed up in my sandwich. Again. I don't have anything to eat, and I'm very hungry. Can you please have dinner ready when I get home? Thanks. How's your day? Not good. Is dinner ready yet? No. Didn't you get my message? No, I've been out with the goats all day. <laughs> Talk back, the goat's talking to you. Could you go inside and make dinner, please? <laughs> sure. Thank you. <laughs> Your bowl, James. James? Is there any wool in this? No. I think I've had enough. Thanks for dinner, Sharon. But she didn't need a thing. There was no wool in it, I promise. I was really careful this time. James? Balikashi. 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 Honey, have you seen the sheep's rectal thermometer? <laughs> Ba 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 
Sharon. Sharon? <clears throat> Sharon? 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 Don't leave me. I, I need you. Ba 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 